Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Today we're gonna be talking about how uh, to handle a screen or a device orientation. We, this time with stack view, uh, you know, for vertical and horizontal. So uh, let's start our uh, project. So uh, before doing that, uh, maybe you'd like me to show you what will be our screen uh, orientation uh, with uh, this stack view and uh, yes uh, let's uh, run it and uh, here we will see one stack view with uh, one picture and one text so when we rotate our uh, device uh, you will see that this picture will go on the left side and the uh, text on the right side and uh, you know not so like uh, before okay so let me stop uh, project and also I'm gonna uh, close this okay so uh, and uh, so uh, I say file new project single view app and your iOS Swift screen orientation yeah you know, I, uh, maybe I should say a screen orientation stack here uh, yeah let me close this and say file new project single view app iOS Swift screen orientation stack view. Uh, the reason I uh, you know, changed the name to this one because uh, yeah already existed. Yeah, I'm gonna replace it uh, because I did, this is the main concern for any developer that you know what what about the portrait? What about the landscape? We can stop. Uh, say okay. We can make it make it fixed to only portrait, only landscape here. Uh, yeah, but uh, if you want to have a good, uh, you know, app, you need to handle both. So uh, we can handle this in three different ways so far. Uh, one uh, with uh, program, the program that when device switch, uh, you know, program detected and switch. Or the second one is uh, with uh, two different uh, control view, and uh, the third one is this one uh, with the stack view that I will show you. Uh, you don't need to do any code; uh, just everything with Xcode. But uh, this one, uh, you need to be you know very uh, careful because uh, of uh, the you know some point we have to fix size of our pictures okay uh, so first of all I uh, say one stack view I choose a stack view uh, vertical and I say okay this my stack view get whole screen and uh, then I add constraint to pin it to all sides with zero so now this is fixed with my screen okay and now I start to add my item so the one item will be image so I add image here and uh, also I need to copy one image to my project to use it so, so I'll come to assets directory I'll go to my uh, finder and drag uh, image here and uh, now I'll go in here and in my image I can I will have this image and I can put it there okay then also I need one text view here you know uh, make sure to add it from button okay uh, if not even here you can uh, you know change it but I add it from there now I have to go back to my picture and say okay my picture size should be 
with the constraint should be 37.5 to 37.5 to give some space for picture to be uh, visible okay also for this one even I can add constraint for high for uh, to be 272 okay so uh, now uh, the only uh, the trick that we are gonna do is that we will go to our stack view we will come in uh, attributes uh, as a tab in attributes inspector and uh, in here in top in axis we click on this plus button then we will have uh, we can add one variation so for variation I say for wide I say any but for high I say compact and then I add it okay and then in the new one I'm gonna select horizontal okay so now even here even without running the uh, app when we change the status of your controller to uh, to landscape uh, it will show our uh, text didn't Yes, so uh, let me go to my picture and see. Let me remove this. Uh, see, I say white. Say any and this one compact, add it, and here say horizontal. So this one uh, I add a limitation and oh, sorry, I forgot to add, uh, you know, I just add high, I need to add uh, width as well. Yes, uh, otherwise when you uh, rotate it, it's going to get that. Yeah, here we go. So, uh, that was good that at least we did that uh, add, uh, twice and you saw it. Okay, and uh, so uh, it's good now. Uh, let's uh, try it in uh, simulator. So, uh, so what we did, we put one a stack view and uh, inside the stack view we put one picture on top and text and button. You can do whatever the setup you have and then we rotate it, uh, you know, I add the trick part was that uh, axis that we say in case of uh, uh, rotation, uh, you need to make it horizontal. There you go. So you will see that it's working pretty fine and uh, we can handle our uh, device orientation or our screen orientation. It's not really recommended solution. Uh, I have other better uh, solution. We have two controller. We can find tutorial. I can uh, put a link in there. Also uh, other solution. Uh, with uh, program uh, um, so there are other solutions uh, but uh, this is one solution some case may be useful for you and uh, that's it for today I hope you like it uh, so please give it a thumbs up and uh, don't forget to subscribe for more videos any question in comment please and uh, I wish the best for you have a good one bye bye